good morning viewers welcome to consumer short hand classes get ready five seconds the revenue is in an appeal against an order of the income tax appellate tribunal under section 260a of the income tax act 1961 the assessment year to which the appeal relates is assessment year 2009 2010 the tribunal has allowed the appeal filed by the sc on the ground that the basis for issuing a notice under section 148 for reopening the assessment has not been fulfilled since the assessing officer must have reason to believe that income has escaped assessment the following questions of law have been formulated by the revenue one whether on the facts and in the circumstances of the case the honorable tribunal was justified in quashing the reopening of assessment by ignoring the fact that the assessing officer had sufficient reasons for reopening the case and accordingly assessing the long term capital gains at rupees 72 lakhs against the return long term capital gains of rupees 1 lakh 72000 two whether on the facts and in the circumstances of the case the honorable tribunal was justified in law in not appreciating the fact that the assessing officer had valid reasons to believe that there is escapement of income by the assc who wide his return of income had shown highly inflated cost of construction and improvement 3 whether on the facts and in the circumstances of the case the honorable tribunal was justified in not appreciating the fact that the value of property decided by civil judge kanpur at rupees 1 lakh as per the court decree was rightly adopted by the assessing officer four whether on the facts and in the circumstances of the case the honorable tribunal was justified in not appreciating the fact that the assc during the course of assessment proceedings failed to produce evidence regarding cost of construction and improvement as claimed by him in his return income the notice of reopening under section 148 was issued on the ground that the sc had sold certain immobile property for rupees 31 lakhs whereas the value of property for the purpose of stamp duty was rupees 82 lakhs resulting in an apparent difference of rupees 51 lakhs it was on this basis that the assessing officer sought to reopen the assessment by issuing a notice under section 148 the tribunal has observed that before the assessing officer can reopen an assessment under section 148 there must be a reason to believe that income has escaped assessment as a matter of fact in the present case the finding of the tribunal is that though the sale consideration was rupees 31 lakhs the value for stamp duty purposes as per the circle rate applicable was rupees 82 lakhs in the computation of income while computing the capital gains the ssc had taken into account the higher value of rupees 82 lakhs this factual finding of the tribunal has not been disputed by the revenue under section 147 the assessing officer before proceeding to reopen an assessment must have reason to believe that there is an escapement of income from assessment now it is well settled in view of the decision of the supreme court in the case of cit versus calvinator of india limited that under section 147 an assessment cannot be reopened merely on the basis of mere change of opinion but there must be tangible material before the assessing officer 
to come to a conclusion that there is an escapement of income from assessment reasons as the supreme court observed must have a link with the formation of the belief this decision was of course rendered in the context of the provisions of section 147 as they then stood but the fundamental principle is that there must exist reasons to believe that income of the sc had escaped assessment and there must be a rational and intelligible nexus between the reasons and the belief in the present case the submission of the sc before the tribunal as recorded in paragraph 3 of the impunged order is that the only reason which was given by the assessing officer for initiating reassessment proceedings was that the property was sold by the sc for rupees 31 lakhs but its value for the purpose of stamp duty as per the circle rate was rupees 82 lakhs resulting in an escapement of income of rupees 51 lakhs the notice under section 148 was available on the record of the tribunal the tribunal also had the benefit of perusing the income tax return filed by the ssc it is on that basis that the tribunal after duly perusing the computation of income submitted by the ssc found that as a matter of fact the ssc had shown a sale consideration of rupees 82 lakhs in the computation of income once this is the position the only basis on which the assessing officer issued notice under section 148 would not possibly give rise to a reason to believe it has been urged on behalf of the revenue that the tribunal has not given due regard to the submission of the revenue that the ssc had reduced the capital gain by increasing the cost of acquisition and the cost of improvement of the property the difficulty in accepting the submission is that in fact this was not the basis on which the assessment was reopened under section 148 the validity of the reopening of the assessment has to be determined on the basis of reasons which are disclosed by the assessing officer the legality of the notice reopening the assessment has to be determined when it is questioned on the basis of the reasons which are recorded by the assessing officer those reasons cannot be allowed to be supplemented subsequently this was also so observed in a judgment of a division bench of the bombay high court in harnad versus income tax officer and others where it was held as follows for the purpose of determining the validity of the challenge to the notice under section 148 the court would have to refer to the reasons recorded by the assessing officer and to those reasons alone hence in our view the tribunal was justified in assessing the correctness of the notice for reopening the assessment under section 148 on the basis of the reasons which were disclosed by the assessing officer those reasons as the tribunal noted could not give rise to a reason to believe that income had escaped assessment for the simple reason that in the computation of income the ssc had adopted the circle rate which is higher than the sale consideration hence the appeal will not give rise to any substantial question of law the appeal is accordingly dismissed there shall be no order as to the cost